Hello and welcome to A Word of Hope for Saturday of the second week of Lent. I'm Brother Scott and I'm the tech guy who puts this all together, you know. But it is also the Solemnity of St. Joseph and it is the second anniversary of A Word of Hope. <laughs> but let's get right to the scripture because it talks about hope today. This is from Paul's letter to the Romans, and he's talking about Abraham, our father in the faith, saying what an incredible thing that Abraham believed, because... And so he says, Abraham is our father in the sight of God, in whom he believed, who gives life to the dead and calls into being what does not exist. He believed hoping against hope that he would become the father of many nations. Hoping against hope. But not hoping for no reason. And that's the part I want to bring out here today. Because he's trusting God, who is trustworthy. We don't have to hope in nothing. You know, I hope this war goes okay. I don't know, though, because there's a lot of people pulling in other directions. But my hope in God... <laughs> you know, if you would have asked me two years ago, could we do this, keep this up for two years? I would have said, no possible way. No, 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 because we don't want to record them way in advance. We've been doing these all just, you know, a few days in advance always, or a day in advance, often the night before, because to bring you a word of hope, the world is changing so fast that we had to capture, what does it look like today? What do I need hope in today? The pandemic was moving so fast, and, and now the war is moving so fast. But to do this, every day, day after day, and right at the last minute, tis impossible, right? Tis impossible. But when it got tight, I'd pray. I'd say, God, you're leading us to do this. You got to help me get it done because it's not getting done today. And God always came through. We were late a few times, but I don't think we've missed once. And we've had a lot of hope. This has really sustained us and you. And I know that from the many kind words you've sent back to us about what this means to you. And I thank you for those. It helps keep us going, you know. And even the donations you've sent to help fund this work. We never asked for them, but they help to keep it going. So we've been doing this for a long time. Because we trust that this is what God wants us to do. This is what we need to be done. And so God makes it happen. And so I think that's what our word of hope for today is. There's nothing too difficult if God wants it to happen. We can hope against hope if we're trusting in God. We can make anything happen. So as sure as this cold and rainy day <laughs> will lead us to spring, though I don't see it now, I know it will come. More surely, God will find a way for us through all of this to bring us to where we need to be, to where we want to be. If we can just trust him, then we can have hope against hope. God bless you this day.